Mr. Holster here, having a little coffee in the tack room this morning. <clears throat> Haven't been able to make or upload any videos in the last few days, because if you follow my channel, you know we got that new bowl last year. Well, he must have gotten, gotten busy real quick upon getting here, because the calves are dropping day after day after day. And was, there was no hesitation on him getting to work, I guess. <laughs> It's like he, uh, I don't know I put it politely, um, got to know the gals all within 48 hours, pretty much, yeah, because they're just no space between them, so kind of been working hard on trying to separate them out and, and keep them from, get them into their own, own pens while they calf, and it's hard to, hard to do when you bait, Barely get one set up, and you realize there's another one you got to get set up there. We're not, they usually don't come that close together. So, yeah, it's been a, a busy week to say the least. And on top of that, we had a good 10 inches of snow over the weekend. So, big mess to clean up. And now it's, now it's getting, and I have no complaints about it getting warm, but it's kind of making a mess. So I've been way too busy to upload a, my my next uh, top five guns of the movies that I was gonna do, but we'll get that we'll get to that hopefully later this week. Tomorrow night on the the hard target pre show, we're gonna be looking at a Ruger. You might want to tune in and check that out for this week. And uh, I wanted to before I leave you here this morning, I want to talk about this holster. Because I got it, I got it shaped in nicely. And if you saw the video on this the other day, the JM4 Tactical Holster, if we can get it. There we go. The JM4 Tactical Holster. You see it shaping in really nicely to this Sig, and it's got these magnets in it, which work quite well, and they retain the the gun well, but it still comes in and out. And it, and it comes in and out a little bit easier when it's in your pants, too, because the strength on the magnet up to the gun is not quite as strong when you get something in between the two magnets. And it works quite well. I've been quite impressed with this. I've only worn it for a couple of days, so... I'll come back and do a thorough review after I've used it quite a bit and, and, and used it on the Bobcat, because that was a real intent, but I could see this... It just being a fantastic holster to keep your firearm in for your home defense gun. This is the kind of holster that would really work well for that gun. I, I've i always been hesitant to leave a firearm uh, sitting in a lockbox to use in a situation like that without having some type of holster along with that. Because it just... I, I like the ability to slip it in the holster and not have to have it in my hand if everything turns out to be a false alarm. Especially if you got guests in the house. Nobody wants to wake up to see you walking around with a handgun in your hand, you know? So, I like to have a, a holster that I can use in whatever I may be sleeping in or with a robe. And this would work very well for that I think at least in my situation now, your mileage may vary depending on what you sleep in and I don't want to know don't don't type that in down below I, I just soon be ignorant of these things but at any rate I can see using this and I could see using it also if I had one for my shower gun <laughs> I think that would work too very nicely made holster and I'm really impressed with it so far but far from done evaluating and playing with it so we shall see I'll, I'll do a video down the road just on the holster. We'll talk about it. I just wanted to mention, though, it's really kind of shaping up and looks nice, I think. I'm, I'm pretty impressed with it so far. So I'd throw that out there. That's the the JM4 Tactical. I don't know if I did that or not. The JM4 Tactical holster. Yeah. Kind of like it. Other than that, you're all up to speed. Tomorrow night, we're going to have the... Hard target range show, and we're going to be looking at a Ruger. So there you go. 
and hopefully by by the end of the week I'll get some more of of my uh, top five movie guns out because I I got a couple I really want to do I just with the calving and everything that's going on I've just been too busy so thanks for tuning in guys if you like my channel please subscribe till next time go out and stay safe <laughs> that's five minutes of your life listen to me babble yeah, and you'll never ever ever get get that back again though I will. <laughs>